so in this video i'm going to explain about the insertion operations in a binomial heap so given element now i'm going to insert all these element in the binomial heap so first i will going to create a binomial heap that's given the first element is 7 so 7 i'm going to insert and this is nothing but a h i'm assuming that this is my binomial heap 7 mm -hmm. because it's 7 single element so i have created a binomial heap 7 this is just a node and their degree is 0. Now the another element come 2. I have created 2. Here you do remember that first step here I am just here we perform that create the binomial heap and then we have performed union operation. So two things we will do for inserting an element in the binomial heap and one more thing is that here I am working on the mean binomial heap. Here I am working on the mean binomial heap. It means that it's going to follow the property of the mean heap. So 7 is come. 7 I have inserted and their degree is 0. Now the 2 comes. So I have created another binomial heap. I am assuming that this is the H1 and their degree is also 0. So if it is 2 binomial tree is having same degree, we will perform union operation so after the performing union operation here because i am following the binomial mean binomial heap it means that the minimal minimum uh, minimum value will become the root of the uh, children so 2 is here the root and 7 become the leftmost children of 2 so after the union operation we'll get this one after the union operation we'll get this 2 and 7 then after my next element is 4 so i have created 4 here created binomial heap so this is h this is h1 now the next element is 17 17 i have inserted this is h now both is having same degree with both is having same degree and this one is having b1 so we have we already told that if it is two binomial degree binomial tree is having same degree we will perform union so after this performing union we'll get this one after the performing union we'll get this one right so now their degree change this is b1 and this is b1 now you, you can see that here still there is a two binomial tree is having same degree there is a two binomial tree is having same degree then what we will going to do we will perform the binomial sorry union operation so if you perform union operation what we will going to do we will check that the root value of the tree root value of the tree which root is having lesser value that will become the root and the next one is become the left children of that root so here 2 is nothing but a root 2 is the parent and 4 is become the leftmost children of 2 so here if you observe that the 4 is the c 4 is the leftmost children 4 is the leftmost children c 17 is not the leftmost children 2 is the leftmost children sorry 4 is the leftmost children of 2 and 17 is the leftmost children of 4 so after the merging we got this one and their order is now 2 so now my next element is 1 so first i have inserted here first first in first created the binomial heap now the next element is 11 so i have created 11 their degree is 0 and we 11 is degree is also 0 so both is having the same degree then we will going to perform union operation so after performing union operation as well as the following the mean heap property will get this one will get this one and their order is now b1 their order is now b1 and their order is b2 so next element is what what is the next element now next element is 6 so 6 i have inserted and their degree is 0 and next element 8 their degree is also 0 so now i'm going to merge this because this both binomial tree is having the same degree we will perform that union operation here so after the union operation will we will get that value 6 and 8 this one will get that and their degree is 1 and this one degree is 1 and their degree is 2 so if you observe that this binomial heap two binomial heap binomial tree is having the same degree so again we perform merging again we perform the merging and after the merging after the merging you will get this one after the merging will get this one and their degree is now 2 their degree is now 2 then after this their de this degree is also 2 so there is a 2 binomial tree is here is having 
same degree again we will perform union again we will perform in here union operation between this both both uh, binomial tree then after we'll get this tree after the performing binomial union operation we'll get that uh, this tree and their order is p3 right their order is p3 now we'll see that what is the because now so far this is following my binomial heap property and this is the bi valid binomial heap now we'll see that what is my next element so my next element is 15 so i have inserted 15 and their degree is 0 next element is 10 i have also inserted 10 their degree is also 0 so see that there is a two binomial heap is having same bino binomial tree is having same degree this is the binomial uh, sorry degree is 3 then we will perform uh, union operation between 15 and 10 and after that afterward we'll get this after the merging we'll get this after the merging we'll get we'll get this tree after that we have said that we will perform the uh, union operation between 10 and 15 so you will get this one and their order is now 1 their order is now b1 and this order is b2 and there is a one more element is left that 20 so i have inserted 20 and their degree is 0 their degree is 0 here right now there is no element so we will stop here so we will stop here so total total node is how many 2 4 6 8 10 and 11 so total here 11 node i have inserted and how many binomial tree is here how, how many binomial tree is three binomial tree is there right and their degree is what their degree is b0 b1 and b2 their degree is B0, B1 and B2. If you convert this 11 into the binary format, I have already told that, I have already told in the previous video that if it is number of node is 11 or any number, so number of possibility binary tree, sorry, binomial tree, possible binomial, maximum possible binomial tree is log base to n. That much is possible because if you convert this 11 plus 1, if you convert this 11 into the binary format, that number of bit is, number of bit is, log base to n plus 1 uh, that much bit is possible so that much binomial tree is also possible while converting the binomial he so if you convert the 11 in the binomial uh, sorry in binary bit you will get it like this you will get this binomial bin, uh, binary format so look at that wherever the one wherever the one that tree so and uh, here i will start from msb or we can say that right to left right to left right so this is the zeroth location so this is the b0 binomial trees this is i will not take this is b1 this is b1 and this is b2 zero i have not taken so how how many set with one is called in the if we call call uh, one in a binary format that's called set bit and also we can say that wherever the one wherever the one that much binary uh, binomial tree possible in a binomial heap so how many binomial heap uh, possible in the uh, 11 node uh, binomial heap three binomial tree is possible and that too we got it here b0 and b1 sorry there is a one more one one uh, uh, mistake it's 11 uh. so this is sorry this is this is not b1 this, uh, this is b3 this is b3 this is b3 and this is b1 so here is that we got that b0 and this is b1 this is b1 sorry i think i think the conversion of the binomial heap is uh, something uh, uh, 11 uh, 11 so 11th binary bit at that time i have written wrong binomial binary format so the 11 if you convert the binary bit of the 11 we'll get it this one so this is this is eighth position this is four and this is two and this is one right so if you convert the binary format like that you can convert this so this is the zeroth location and this is b1 and this two will not going to come and b3 so how many binomial tree three binomial tree is possible and that is we have that is 
we have this is the this is now final binomial heap after the insertion of the all this node and we were getting and how many operation we were performing while inserting the element two operation one is that we were every time we were creating the binomial heap every time we were creating the single node binomial heap and then after if it is violating the bino uh, sorry if it is two node two binomial binomial tree is having same degree we were performing that union operation and I pre in previous video i have already explained that the union operation is taking time is order of base 2 log n because every time we were in we were merging the two binomial tree every time perform uh, merging the binomial tree so number of my binomial tree how many binomial tree we were merging that time complexity so union operation will take order of base to log n or for creating the binomial heap so every time we were creating the single node binomial heap so that's taking constant time then that, that's taking constant time so if we observe that the time complexity for the insertion that time complexity is also order of order of uh, 1 plus log base 2 in this is the time complexity if you write it in the final final uh, uh, time complexity that's nothing but a order of base 2 log n so for the insertion operation also the time complexity will be the order of log base to n and for the union operation also the time complexity is order of log base to n. So that's all about the insertion operation in the binomial heap. Thank you for watching my video.